ain't no pictures going on. No, it's a lot. <laughs> but I definitely, you know, oh, you know, yeah. you know, he takes well, it well, too, you know, and, you know, it's all a good point. Just, it's just how I relate to now that he's no longer 360, what's your, what's your nickname? What's your nickname for him? Can't be Xbox. He's still fat for him. You know, he's still a, he's still a large human being, so it doesn't matter how much weight he does. He's still just massive. So I'm still always fat for him. What kind of things do y'all do in addition to eating together? Like, do you go out to eat together? What kind of things do y'all do? Uh, everything. Um, you know, we go to. I take him to the park. Take him to get his hair cut. How did you approach the, the way Saturday went for the defense? It was it kind of a, maybe a little bit of a wake up call that as good as y'all oh, can be, yeah. you still got to get out there and do what you got to do. Yeah, definitely a wake up call. Uh, I mean, everybody, the whole D line uh, in the film room, we know we all didn't do too well, so we all went in there with open ears, trying to learn and see what what we could have done differently. Uh, <laughs> no one really came with bad attitudes. We know. I mean, it was practice, so I mean that's why we have practice for those type of mistakes. So I mean, everybody just wanted to. You get out the next day and have a better day. Uh, we don't we don't try to dawn too much on the past. Just try to work on the future, pretty much. What excites you about turning the page on camp and kind of now getting getting ready to focus on an opponent? Uh, I, I enjoy game prep. I don't know why. Uh, I just it's, it's closer and closer to game time. Uh, the lights turn on. You just gotta let it go. Then uh, I mean that's pretty much what what I love. Uh, Jerby Meadows is pretty tough out here. <laughs> Uh, so we're getting over there back to the regular fields would be good too. I'm, I'm ready for that. Christian, what's the best Dexter Lawrence Christian Wilkins story that you can tell? Where, where you guys have been out in public or someone that you can tell? What you think it is? Uh, what you can tell? Let's right. See. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hmm. uh, maybe on his officials. Um, just uh, you know. I took advantage of all my officials and everything. I ate it up, ate good. So like that was just the first time. Obviously, we always go back to food. I, a lot of our stories I feel like happen with food, but just basically on his officials, I'm challenging them, just telling them, I'm like, that you know, it's, it's all it's all covered. Just get like two steaks, like three you know. Steaks. <laughs> yeah. So he was obviously just tearing it up, you know, just going at it. So that was just funny to see, like, and just how we bonded then too. Just definitely knew like you know our connection would be tight, you know, if he decided to come here. And even if it didn't, I'm sure we would have had some type of relationship, you know. Obviously that he did come here. How do y'all like your steaks? Medium well. Medium, yep. Mm -hmm. I don't like that blo no blood. I don't like none of that. I, Medium well. I like the outside nice and crispy, the inside a little bit juicy. You know, no, medium no. well is a little bit of A little, a little, just a medium little Medium well, bit of not red medium. Is okay. no, a little bit of red is okay. <laughs> mm. Anything else? Thank you. Already.